Hey, what's happening, everybody? It's me, your resident supervillain, Mr. J. Washington, and I am excited to bring what I have to you guys. I was honored to be able to go to Atlanta to visit the set of the CW's Black Lightning. Black Lightning re-debuts for season two on Tuesday, October 9th. I got a chance to be a part of the massive roundtable with about four or five other journalists, and we did interviews with every single series regular on the cast, yes. So we talked to Cress Williams, Christine Adams, Damon Gupton, James Remar, uh, China Ann McClain, Nafisa Williams, uh, Marvin Jones, and Jordan Calloway. We got to talk to them all about what season one meant to them and what they expect in season two. Now, I would have had this up for you guys earlier, but there's a lot of spoilers they gave away. And so I couldn't give you all that content, but I wanted to give you all what they thought. Uh, I apologize for some of the interviews where the camera either shut off and I had to go to just strictly audio and things like that. But nonetheless, oh, also, I got a chance to talk to showrunner and executive producer Salima Kiel. Didn't get video for that one, but it's a straight audio. I will let, let you guys hear that as well. So I have a lot of these coming up. It's going to be a nice long time for you guys. Enjoy a bunch of content. This is brought to you by myself and the people at Cinelinks.com. Thank you to Cinelinks for allowing me to be a part of this with you all and to be able to Trent to go to Atlanta to get this great have this great time to see the set of Black Lightning uh, to speak with the cast and I want you guys to enjoy it so I'm gonna kick it off with all these interviews right now so tell us a little bit about your relationship with Lynn this season mm -hmm. when you guys are back together yeah Ish. There's always that, but like a, some conditions around, you know, yeah. like the relationship. So what's that dynamic going to look like as we get into this? Well, it's interesting, you know, because I even forget, you know, I made a, we made a point um, that they're formally divorced. They're not like separated, they're divorced, but like I made a point of um, just from the moment I read the first episode, the pilot, that Jefferson still wears his wedding ring. Um, just because he has not given up hope and so he's always wore his wedding ring unless he was like you know fighting crime in the suit or whatever um so they are still formally divorced but they're it's funny because i don't know if we we haven't talked about it and christine and i we haven't like i think we kind of both adopt need to know basis information so we haven't even gone to the writers and go so what's the deal we just kind of put our head down and just started moving forward which is really what the characters are going through you know they the fina finale happened and we season two starts a week after that mm -hmm. and i think as a couple as a family we've just kind of picked up our pieces and start trying to move forward and there's literally no time to have the you know the what do they call it define the relation yeah. the DTR <laughs> there's no time to have it because it's like we put we you know then something hits us and then we gotta deal with that and then this and and so we haven't as actors and the characters haven't either I think we're just kind of playing house and it's great because you know as a um a fan of the show and the characters I want them to be like remarried and together mm -hmm. so at least for the time being we get to at least pretend <laughs> that we are but what do the girls want you know to sort of the the daughters yeah I mean I think who wouldn't want their their you know pa yeah because they they yeah. well <laughs> you don't want <laughs> yeah love them but um, I think that they want them back together they want them you know uh, they want to be a family again and oddly enough again because of just how fast and how many things life is throwing at us that i think nobody really gets to talk about it a whole lot we just do it right and and so far we've just been doing it so yeah <laughs> You are a badass now. Yeah. Thank you. You are a badass now. You know, you may Lynn Stewart now, like we were talking about with Celine, she's more, she's not taking any shit for lack of right. words. What made, what besides the way she was last season, how did you decide to approach the character that way? I mean, you know, honestly, I do what the writers write mm. generally. And I think I've been so lucky as this kind of character in this kind of show because there was always a discussion of her not having superpowers and mm. how is that going to feel and how would she, you know, really sort of navigate this this chapter which would be the girls discovering their powers and and I think what is so great is that, you know, 
Lynn has kind of evolved into this much more complicated, complex, you know, ultimately she's protective mother. That That's all, all always first and foremost. Black Lightning, all new episodes, Tuesday, October 9th, only on The CW and stream free the next day on The CW app. Well, I hope you enjoyed these interviews. I got the opportunity to be a part of questions that I ask, questions that other journalists ask to the cast of Black Lightning. It is going to be an amazing and incredible second season. You've heard about one of the special guests already, Erica Alexander from Living Single, from The Cosby Show, from the movie Get Out, being a part of Black Lightning season two as the character Perenna, who many of us think may be Looker. You guys are gonna be excited about that, but there are so many more guests that are coming this second season that I want you to be just as much excited about and I really want to tell you all but I cannot but nonetheless make sure you check out Black Lightning again Tuesday when it comes back Tuesday October 9th on the CW and every subsequent Tuesday if you haven't saw the first season the entire first season is available to watch on Netflix go ahead and do that and when you tweet about this make sure you use the hashtag Black Lightning use the hashtag get lit and if you're not following me on Twitter, do it already. Follow me Twitter, Instagram, at Mr. J Washington, M-R-J-A-Y. You should know how to spell Washington. Uh, make sure you follow Cinelinks.com and go to Cinelinks on Twitter at Cinelinks, C-I-N-E-L-I-N-X. All right? Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoy. Get lit for the second season. I'll holler at you later. I'm out of here. Peace.